what do you guys all think the worst Maggie in the game is? Well, in my opinion, it has to be this new one that I pulled, the Smiling Angel Pamela thing. Smiling Angel Decoy. Summons a decoy that diverts the enemy's attention. The decoy will be attacked for several times and it explodes after a period of time dealing earth damage. Lightning type enemies will be weakened. It's, it's so useless, like, the only weapon or set that you could probably use this on well is the Mud Digger set, so, yeah. I mean, it's, I'm just gonna show you, I'm so speechless at how useless it is, but if it's one, if it's good for one thing, it's scaring me, or whatever, I'll show at the end of the video, but, yeah, I mean, let's go to a Lightning Behemoth, so... Let's just go to, what's a good one? Galdor, uh, Tehran. We'll start with the Tehran. So, diverts the enemy's attack, so it should only attack that thing. So it's like a Scorch decoy, so if you remember what that Maggie is, all the way back, I don't have it, but yeah, it's like that, but in my opinion, I think it's even worse than scorch decoy because like you'll see soon but first of all the charge time is horrendous so you know how nature's descent is supposed to take super long to charge well it takes longer than nature's descent so you throw a heart pamela the cast time is also super bad it takes quite a long time to cast so now it should be attacking pamela so yeah as you see but if you're using it with any other close range weapons I mean, if you're standing in the wrong direction, like if you're standing close to it, you're gonna get hit. So yeah, as you see, it just blew up. I think it did like 15,000 damage. You can throw another one out. And like big AOE attack enemies. So I'm, I'm not gonna cancel this. I'm just gonna roll away. See, so everyone will get hit no matter what. So that did 150,000 damage, a bit better. But everyone gets hit, so pretty useless again enemies that have many aoe ta attacks like body slams and stuff again everyone will get hit even if it's targeting the decoy pretty sure you i wonder if you can throw two at once so yeah, you can throw two at once well the thing is if you're in like a group tower group it won't always attack the decoy so that's another thing that I find pretty annoying. So yeah, it's like... And the fact is that if it's a behemoth that moves around a lot, so this time it Saran didn't fly around as much, but if it's a behemoth that moves around a lot, it doesn't blow up on impact like Scorch Decoy. So sometimes it won't do anything at all. It will just be there and say over here, but in Japanese. So if I could show, for example, a behemoth with lots of AOE attacks. So a perfect example could be Elgardo. Attacks that attack everyone. So annoying. Yeah. Pabella doesn't do anything. <laughs> it's so useless. Like, I mean, I'm completely speechless at why they would release a Maggie this bad at this point in the game. So... This should be fine, all good. Okay, so, as you see, it's attacking every... See, like that. Attacks that attack everyone. Like, the cast time is also so horrendous that it's not even... Sometimes it's not even worth casting because you're going to get hit by something. So this attack is also very annoying. Now we'll throw Pamela. So now, hopefully, it should start attacking Pamela. And this attack's also super annoying. So yeah, like, there's no point releasing Maggie's like this at this point in the game if everything's gonna attack everything. So I don't know what happened there, actually. Like, it blew up twice or something, but... It, so I'm a bit speechless. Maybe it's not as bad as I thought it was. What? <laughs> okay, so it might not be as bad as I thought it was. And the best way to test it is on Galdora, the tanky one. So just now it did like 300,000 damage. I'm 
com I'm really confused right now, but like I, my point just then was to prove that on Behemoth with lots of attacks that attack everyone, it's gonna be useless until for some reason it decides to do like a million damage like just now, which again is a bit weird. So let's just see how that worked. So if we just get to it. it's so annoying how it takes so long to charge as well like a maggie this useless shouldn't take this long to charge is what i'm trying to point out right now so now if we throw pamela it should start attacking pamela i'm sorry pamela i don't know how i hit the neck then as well so yeah there you go again it like blew up twice just now so sometimes some stuff happens now if we chuck pamela okay because i don't want to deal with the ult i'm going to try and cancel it so pamela's down there by the feet yeah so this time it only blew up once i guess like gal the behemoth has to physically hit the thing when it blows up for it to actually deal proper damage but again that's the problem it doesn't blow up the moment it gets hit so now if I understood correctly, again, it didn't attack. Yes, yeah, so I think that's how it works. So if it attacks Pamela as it, so if it attacks Pamela as, um, as it blows up, then I think that's when it does that really big amount of damage. The range is also pretty bad. Okay, this time it's going to ult and I won't be able to dodge it. Okay, there, there, see? So yeah, it might not be completely used as I, th as I thought it was, but if that is the case, they should just make it so it blows up and deals that much damage when it gets hit. Yeah, so for all of you that thought it was completely useless, it might not be. I still find it completely useless. But now I'll show you the scary thing. So... It's like Ghost Pamela or whatever you want to call it. So I'm actually out of, I'm out of stuff to kill. I, I, I spent quite a bit of time killing all my A and S rank behemoths. Or like n nearly 900 A lapis and 120 S lapis. So hopefully I can show what really scares me here. So we just need to kill Vakahorn and charge up Pamela's decoy so you can also do this to scare people I find it really personally I find it really frightening so after the end of a battle right so once the battle ends what you do is three two timer goes down chuck Pamela you throw Pamela out right okay behemoth fight done there you go, Ghost Pamela, like... <laughs> See, it's so scary! <laughs> and you can stay on this page and it should still keep saying. There you go, like... <laughs> it's so scary. <laughs> it's... <laughs> but yeah, this was what I think the most useless Maggie in the game is. I mean, it's hard to... For the behemoth to actually time the hit as it blows up as well but yeah that was all for this video for everyone else that pulled it um I, I, I feel bad for you just like you should feel bad for me but yeah that was all for this video i hope you guys all enjoyed bye